Welcome to my channel. I am Idris Dev. Today, I'm going to talk about the Ars Poetica by Horace. Uh, part first, it is the uh, uh, forces. Poem must have organic unity, according to the Horace. The poet is free to indulge in his fancy, and he must not create monster figure, and must not lapse into the absurdity. All the poet should have good knowledge to write a poem. There must exist a harmonious relationship between the part and the whole. The subject of the poem should be chosen wisely, and the subject of the poem must suit both style and the power of the poem. A wise discretion must be exercised in the use and the choice of word. The poet has liberty to kind the new words and revive the old one, but this should be done with much discretion. The subject of the poem must suit both style and power of the poem. A wise discretion must be exercised in the use and choice of words. The poet has liberty to coin the words and to use them in his poetry. Language. Language is like a tree, and words are like leaves, and which wither every year and succeeded by new ones. And the poet should ponder on the usage of language during the writing. During the writing, the poet should revive the absolute word and give them accuracy. But poma, according to the Horace, plot should be based. On the family story, new themes must be invented. For the successful treatment, the boy requires great skills and arts. In the characterizations, uh, the poet must be true to his poetry and character must be consistent. And the dramatic style must also be different in accordance with the character's mood and circumstances. The dramatists must know what to represent and what to report to the audiences. Plays shouldn't have uh, more than uh, three characters. The fourth character should never be introduced and the chorus should be the part of the play. The art of poetry requires incessant toil. The point should revise his body several times so that it gains artistic excellence. A point must begin observe of man and manners. He should constantly read the book of life and talk the true language from it. A point should instruct the people in his body, give them pleasure. For the sake of pleasure, he shouldn't himself indulge in absurdities. Writing the body, he should mix body with the prophet. He should avoid superfluity so that people give heed to his instruction in the body. This kind of body enriches the publishers and prolongs the fame of the author. Minor fault may be forgiven, but point should avoid the poor as much as he can. Art and nature are the essential part of the body. Poet Wit and training are also essential. Uh, the idea of the poetic expression is absurd. So that is all from my side. Thank you very much.